there are many environmental agents which are not harmful but they become active alkylating agents only after they are metabolized by the cell so one such agent is a mixture of polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons commonly known as PAH they are formed by the incomplete combustion of the burning wood or coal used as a fuel Similar type of polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons are also present in tobacco sm smoke and charbroiled meats. There are more than 100 different types of PAH compounds present in the environment. So here are some examples. So these include benzopyrene. These two are benzopyrene and this is chrysine and this is dibenzanthracene. So here are some examples of polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons which can damage DNA. The common structural feature in all uh, polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons is the presence of two or more fused aromatic rings. These are not able to damage DNA unless they are metabolically activated in the cell. So they may get entry uh, into the cell from the environment and uh, uh, into the cell they are activated and these activated products can damage DNA otherwise these uh, PAH are not uh, uh, harmful for the DNA one of uh, the polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbon is benzoapyrene it is converted into an active epoxide alkylating agent through a metabolic pathway in the cell. So here is the pathway which converts this uh, pH into epoxide which is uh, a damaging agent. So this is benzoapyrene. This is activated by the oxygen and it is converted into benzoapyrene 78 epoxide. So this uh, here you can see this is 7,8 epoxide and uh, in the uh, further uh, pathway uh, water is added and this epoxide 7,8 epoxide uh, is converted into benzoapyrene 7,8 dihydrodiol so uh, again this is not uh, uh, damaging uh, for the DNA and this is again activated by the oxygen and it is converted into the highly reactive or damaging agent which is benzoapyrene 78 dihydrodiol 910 epoxide so this epoxide will alkylate dna so cytochrome uh, p450 enzymes are involved in the activation of this ph Cyt these enzymes are not uh, very specific so if they are not very specific they may act on some other substrates so in the same way they act on pH such as benzoapyrene and add oxygen atoms to form reactive three membered epoxide rings these epoxides then alkylate DNA causing replication errors that result in mutations and uh, due to these mutations the cells ultimately convert the normal cells ultimately will convert into the cancer cells so here are some examples of uh, the damage DNA damage by pH for example so this is uh, pH uh, this one and uh, here it is attached with the C8 of guanine and in this way it form a, a mono adduct similarly here uh, this uh, hole uh, is attached with the N7 of guanine this is N7 atom of guanine so in this two ways it can damage uh, guanine base but it can also uh, form mono adduct with adenine so here uh, the example of uh, mono adduct of adenine and here it is attached with the N9 of adenine 
so in this way these uh, mono adducts are formed by the active agents which are uh, formed after uh, metabolic activation of pah